وَضْرِبْ لَهُمْ مَسَلَ الْحَيَاتِ الدُّنْيَا Strike to them, O Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم, a similitude for the life of this world. كَمَائِنْ أَنزَلْنَاهُ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ It's like the water that we send down from the heaven. Rain comes down. فَاخْتَلَتَ بِهِ نَبَاتُ الْأَرْضِ And with this water, rain, water of rain, you know, intermingles the vegetation of the earth, of the land and comes out. Otherwise, the land was without any greenery, no vegetation, barren. Now water came down, rain poured, and now there's vegetation. So vegetation intermingled with that water and came out. After some time, this vegetation, this becomes dry and broken in pieces. And now the air is taking it from this side to that side, etc. وَكَانَ اللَّهُ عَلَىٰ كُلِّ شَيْءٍ مُقْتَدِرًا And verily Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is powerful over everything. Now this is, you know, we, our body, as I said in the Friday sermon today, those of you who are present, our animal existence, our body comes from clay. Our ruh comes from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Just as the rain comes down, and the vegetation of the earth comes out due to that rain. Ruh comes from there, and the body, which is coming from the clay, they do join together, and that is the life of this world. When we die, the body will go back. But the ruh and the nafs, the life, they will go to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. المال والبنون زينة الحياة الدنيا Wealth and sons They are the adornment of this life of this world Now this word zina is coming for the third time here in this surah First of all in the first section we had إِنَّا جَعَلْنَا مَا عَلَى الْأَرْضِ زِينَةَ اللَّهَا لِنَبْلُوَهُمْ أَيُّهُمْ أَحْسَنُ عَمَلَا Whatever is over this earth we have made it an adornment for this world It looks very beautiful and we want to test whether you love this world or you love us. This is the test. Number two, we found, Oh Muhammad, your eyes should not go to those people who have zenith of dunya, adornment of dunya. These people who are rich, who are the chieftains, they have the adornment of this worldly life. But you shouldn't go towards them. You shouldn't pay more attention to them. You, pay poor, you devote more attention to your poor, your ahle iman, your brothers in faith. Although they are poor, but they go on praying Allah, calling in the morning and evening, calling upon Him. And now third time here. Al-malu wal-banuna zinatul hayat dunya This wealth that you have in this world and your sons, they are adornment of this life of this world. But the things which will remain are the righteous deeds. Sons will remain here. They are not going to go with you in the grave. Your wealth will remain here. It is not going to go with you in the grave. What will you take into the graves with you? Will be the good deeds. They will be permanently with you. If you have done some. Well, baqiyatu salihat. These the things which remains and which is eternal, they are the good deeds. Khairun in the Rabbi ka sawabam wa khairun amala. And these good deeds are better near your Lord when you, you, when you stand before your Lord. And they are better that you can have hope something that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will reward you for these deeds. Wa yawma nusayyirul jibal. And when we should make the mountains move, they will move. And they will become dust. There will be no mountains. It will all be a plain earth. And you will see this land, this earth, absolutely leveled and plain, without any adornment. Now the skyscraper, skyscraper is gone, buildings gone, palaces gone, even Himalayas gone. All things gone. It's all plain land. وَحَشَرْنَاهُمْ And then we shall gather them, all of them, all human beings. وَلَمْ نُغَادِرْ مِنْهُمْ أَحْدًا And will not leave even one of them, all the human beings. 
فرام آدم علیہ سلاۃ وسلام ٹو دی لاسٹ ہیومن بینگ ہو ول بی دیئر ان از پروجنی ٹل دی اینڈ آف دس ورلڈ ٹل قیاما دے ول آل بی پریزنٹ اوور دیئر دے ول آل بی ریزریکٹیڈ اینڈ دے ول ہیو ٹو اسٹینڈ دیئر اینڈ دین ایز آئی کوٹ اٹ ارلیئر آلسو دی آیات فرام سورت الفجر وجا رب و کمل ملک و صفن صفا وجی یوم جہنم ناؤ اللہ سبحان و تعالیٰ ول ہم سیلف ڈسینڈ اینڈ اینجلس ان روز اینڈ کالمز اینڈ رینکس اینڈ دین یو نو دیر ول بی دی اکاؤنٹیبلٹی آف دی ڈے آف ججمنٹ اینڈ دا ججمنٹس ول بی پاسٹ وہ اور رب کا صفا دے ول بی پریزنٹیڈ بفور دیئر لارڈ ان رینکس اینڈ لائنس لقت جے تو مونا کما خلق دا کم اولا مرہ ویری بیوٹیفل اللہ وڈ سے ناؤ یو ہیو کم ٹو اس ان دی سیم فارم ان وچ وی ہیڈ کریٹڈ یو فار دی فرسٹ ٹائم وٹ واز دیٹ کریشن آف دی فرسٹ ٹائم اینڈ وٹ از دی کریشن آف سیکنڈ ٹائم فرسٹ آف آل آل آف اس ور کریٹڈ ایز اسپرٹس نو باڈیز all the spirits of all the human beings from adam till the last man and we were present there and we made the covenant with allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alastu bi rabbikum alu bala am i not your lord why not oh allah we accept you as our lord this was the covenant this is the covenant of alas we call it so this is and we were all present there But there was no relationship, no father, no son, no grandfather, no grandson. All, all in only the spiritual forms, not the bodies. Then what happened? Then when, you know, this world of matter was created. And now, when a human being's fetus is completed in the womb of the mother, the ruh, the spirit is brought from there and joined with it. And according to a hadith, it is done after four months. It is the hadith from Abdullah ibn Mas'ud radiyallahu anh that for 40 days, you know, it's the Nutfa stage. Then for 40th days, it is Muzga stage, Alaka stage, 3 into 40, 120 days, that is four months. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sends an angel and he blows the ruh into it. Now it becomes human being, just as about Adam, وَإِذَا خَلَقْتُهُ وَسَوَّيْتُهُ وَنَفَقْتُ فِيهِ بِالْرُوحِ فَقَعُوا لَهُ سَاجِدِينَ In the same way, the son of Adam in the womb of his mother, when it is, this fetus is four months old, that ruh is brought and it is blown into him. So now, just as we were standing, all of us, together, before Lord, When we made the covenant, Alastu bi Rabbikum, in the same way, on the day of judgment, we shall be standing all of us together. Father with the son, and grandfather and grandson, all. Adam, from Adam to the last man, which, which will come in this world, they will all be present. لَقَدْ جَيْتُمُونَا كَمَا خَلَقْنَاكُمْ أَوَّلَا بَرَّهُ As we had created you for the first time. Creation for the second time is in the womb of the mother. Bodily creation was in the womb of the mother. First creation was only of the spirits of human beings. What was the Al-Kitab? And now the record of the deeds of the people will be brought and placed. Maybe it is a very giant computer. You know, you only touch one button and the whole film of a human being's life is there. You can see. Whatever he uttered is there. Whatever he did is there. For every being, every human being. وَمُوزِعَ الْكِتَابِ فَتَرَ الْمُجْرِمِينَ مُشْفِقِينَ مِمْ مَا فِي You will see that these culprits, evil doers, will be very much fearful of what is there in this record. وَيَقُولُونَ And they will say, يَا وَيْلَتَنَا آه وَوْ تُو أَسْ مَا لِحَادُ الْكِتَابِ What type of a record it is. لَا يُغَادِرُ صَغِيرَةً وَلَا كَبِيرَةً إِلَّا أَحْسَاهَا It has not omitted even the smallest details. All the sins, they have been commuted here. They have been computed here. Everything is here. And they will find whatever they had done present before their eyes. Your Lord is not going to do injustice to anybody. Everybody will be repaid. What he did. 
ناٹ دیٹ اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ از گوئنگ ٹو پنش ون ود آؤٹ اینی ڈیڈس بیڈ ڈیڈس دیٹ ہی ایر کمیٹیڈ بلائے ازلم و ربو کا احادہ یور لارڈ از ناٹ گوئنگ ٹو پنش اینی بڈی اینڈ ڈو اینی انجسٹس ٹو اینی بڈی 